So I subscribed to this guy, Vladimir, because he studies at Sin Studio, right? But where are his videos? I want to see more. What happened to him? Did he disappear? Nah, I'm still here. Well, so here is painful truth about making videos. It takes time. The time that I could draw or learn Blender. The second issue is with the shooting. Because every time when I take my camera and start to shoot, I switch into director role and my art attention level drops to a pigeon on life support. Whatever, back to our progress at Concept Art Diploma Program. I would say that our classes could be divided into three main areas. First, anatomy knowledge, because anatomy is everything. Second, sketching concepts and being awesome concept artist. And third, rendering and making stuff juicy. By anatomy, I mean that we deepen our anatomy knowledge and not only a human one. It is not only drawing, but also lots of sculpting. Some of us here don't like it, but the tactile building of subjects is important for realizing proportions and relationships. The difference between concept artist and illustrator is bringing the concepts to the table. As I talk to some folks here, as a concept artist, ideas are more important than execution. That's why there is so much emphasis on research, definition, purpose and other design tools. Lastly, the rest of the classes were about making stuff looks nice. So we learn about materials and light behavior, reflection, refraction, fresnel effects and much more. My favorite class was with Charles Wynn. We incorporate real models into our environment by respecting lighting settings. Now we enjoy two weeks of summer break and our focus should slowly be directed to mastering 3D tools such as 3D Code, ZBrush or Blender. And that is everything for today's episode. Thank you for watching and please tell me in comments what kind of content you would like to see. See you next time.